it's funny because I used to, six years ago, not really like the subway. I always tell people something that is very frustrating to you could be the answer to what you're looking for. And that's where I found my beauty is in New York City through photography on the subway. My name is Andreas Ferrios, also known as Mr. NYC Subway. I'm a New York City photographer who specializes in photography on the New York City Subway. Mr. New York City Subway is, I'm a photographer at heart, but what I do is I capture all my content on the New York City Subway. That's my niche. And it could be street photography, it could be collaborations, or it could also be what I have now, a Stranger series, which is commercial content. The main gist of what I do is I bring other artists in, local artists, or I bring in strangers, and I conduct my photo shoots on the subway. The whole part of this series, and what I love about it, is you never know what's gonna happen when you approach a stranger. They might say yes, they might say no, and that's kind of the nature of the beast, is being rejected. And it could be for various reasons, right? Someone has to get somewhere, they have no idea who I am, they don't want to model, so I'm always very understanding. If it's just not the right fit, let that person move on because with every photo shoot you have, there needs to be synergy. One time we did do a photo shoot uh, and it was during New York Fashion Week and we approached this stranger and he was wearing a dress and he had the perfect look. Everything was amazing and fortunately he wasn't in a rush and he knew exactly what we were doing and, and it was just the right fit. We were about to go run the photo shoot and I realized that I forgot my SD card. So I was like, oh no, I don't have a, an SD card on me. I had my camera, I had my battery, but I didn't have an SD card. Fortunately, on that day, he had enough time for us to run over to a photography store and we had to catch a cab and we had to buy an SD card and then we came back and actually ran the photo shoot. That was the only time I've ever been in a situation where I didn't charge my battery or I forgot something. I'm typically always very prepared coming to these photo shoots. That was the one time that we did run into an issue. One thing I will say about Manhattan Portage that I love and I've seen is that it's really a company that creates a very high quality durable and very logistical backpack or fanny pack or biker's backpack that's built to last. And I think that's what I've really learned to understand with Manhattan Portage is their products are not meant to be used for a year or two, but almost indefinitely for a lifetime of a product. I am Andreas Verios, also known as Mr. New York City Subway, and I am New York Tough.